What is going on, everyone, and welcome back to Hearthstone. So as you may imagine, we are back with the Gadgets In expansion, and that officially released today. So we're going to be opening some packs. I had this pre-ordered for a while now. Whoa. A zero gold quest. One moment. Oh God! Shots fired. This job would be uh, mutually beneficial. Join or we smash you. All right. Anyway, <clears throat> we're gonna be opening some packs because this is what I've been saving my gold for, and they had the pre-order thingy. So we're gonna just dump all our gold into it. Uh. 31. Alrighty. Alright, we got 82 packs. Let's see what we get. I know that's a weird number. I apologize, but we got it. Uh, let's get rid of this one first because that one was from like the Tavern Brawl that I forgot to open. Excellent. Now, where everything matters. Let's start started. I actually, before we start, I know you guys are just into it, but... Um, I haven't really kept up with the expansion where I didn't, I didn't want to spoil myself, so I didn't look at all the new cards. I kind of saw a few of them because the official Blizzard Hearthstone, <clears throat> they made some announcements, but I didn't actually go out of my way to look at them. Alright, so we're going to go over this as if I'm completely new to the game and have no idea what's going on. As far as I know, these things... Over here, I think that means you can use it for different classes. Also, it tells you right there. I knew that much. And add a random potion to your hand. I'm not sure what they do. Or what the potions do, anyway. But that's definitely something we're going to be experimenting with. Deal 4 damage, summon a Jade Golem. Excellent, because shamans need more burst damage. Oh my god. That's not bad, actually. <laughs> Whenever your opponent draws a card, gain plus one, plus one. Uh, this doesn't seem that good, but you never know what could happen in the meta. I know a guy. Discover a taunt minion. Okay, then. Oh, potion. Ha, <laughs> it connects. Deal two damage to all minions, so it's essentially a mage version of that warlock demonic thingy. I don't remember what it's called, but that's interesting. All we want are epics and legendaries. Aww, that's so cute. Except I hate this card because all one drops in this game are OP. Well, most of them are actually OP in this game, especially since Hunter... Well, it's not. It's a neutral, the one that they already have, but now they have another one. Give a random taunt minion in your hand 3 3. Uh, oh god, that's gonna change the meta. At the end of your turn, restore one health to your hero. That seems like a terrible card, but you never know. Ooh, a multi class card. Give a random minion 1 1 in your hand. That could be good, potentially. Destroy a minion and one of your mana crystals. So, yeah, if they put that in any other class besides Warlock, that might be good, but I don't know. Something we have to test. Deal two damage, summon a Jade Golem. I don't, I still don't know what the stats on the Jade Golem it is, but... Two mana do two damage. Uh, depending on how the Jade Golem affects gameplay, this may or may not be a good card. Jade Swarmer, summon the Jade Golem. You know what's funny is I've played WoW for about a year and I still have never seen some of these. I still don't know what a Jade Golem. <laughs> Golden Coleman. Oh. Give a random Murloc 1-1 one, one in your hand. That's not bad, actually, for a 1 cost. Alright, 
All right, so restore six health overload. That's actually not that bad at three six. I usually value defense minions with the higher defense, lower attack like that because they are not that bad. Give your demons one one for five four. Eh, average. Jade spirit. I still don't know what a jade golem does. Street trickster zero seven spelled. God, why? Has a plus two attack when you have a weapon. Nope. And we got another one of those. Sorry, I'll try to go through them quicker the more duplicates we get. Just because, like, I actually don't know what half of these things do. Well, that's like <clears throat> a six mana. Six mana, one, one, and then the summons a six. Ah. I mean, you get two minions, essentially, to six, six. That's. At first glance, it looks terrible, but then now that when you think of it, um, you're essentially getting a 6-6 six, six and a 1-1 one, one compared to the Boulderfist Ogre, which is a 6-7. Uh, I don't know if I'd rather play that over a Boulderfist, but you never know. Got another one of those. At the end of your turn, give a random minion 2-2 two, two in your hand. It's weird. Dispatch Kodo. Deal damage equal to this minion's attack. Wait, so isn't that the exact same thing as the Stampeding Kodo, except this one is 2-4 instead of 3-5? Okay, then. One day I'll get an epic or legendary. That is dumb. That should be an a druid thing, but I don't like that. Okay, we've seen all those now. Nothing that really stood out. Give all your minions in your hand plus one plus one for one cost. That should be a secret. Am I just bad, or just, have I never seen these in WoW either? Jeez. One day, we'll see an epic or legendary. Alright, this is the definition of a trash card. Do you know what destroys it? Everything. Gadgets and social light. Hmm. I'd rather play the 2-1 Voodoo Doctor than this, honestly. One extra health on that does not really matter. Man, those are terrible. Ooh, we got an epic. First epic in 11 packs. Wait, what? Transform all enemy minions into random ones that cost one less. That is a good card now. That is a good one that we're going to be seeing regularly. Burgly Bully. Whenever your opponent casts a spell, add a coin to your hand. Okay, then. So, probably not going to be played. I don't know, though. Silence a minion for five mana. Or I could not do that. <laughs> Well, we got two of them right off the bat. All right, when will my first legendary appear? Usually it's one in like 30 packs you get a legendary. Golden Coleman. <laughs> Friendly bartender. Rare. 
I saw this card before. The Bomb Squad, deal 5 damage to an enemy minion, deal 5 damage to a hero. Uh, I have no idea if that will be good. Maybe an arena. Trash. <laughs> also trash. Things with one minion or one health are generally not that good in my opinion. Unless it has an outstanding effect, usually it's not worth playing. Potion of Polymorph. Whenever your opponent plays a minion, transform it into a one. So that's a Polymorph, but a secret. Thanks, Blizzard Hearthstone development team. Why would you make another hard removal? Four mages. The next secret you play, the steering call has zero. Hmm. That might be used, actually. That has a pretty good effect. Freeze an enemy. Got another potion. I may have seen that in WoW. <laughs> Remove one durability from your opponent's weapon. That might be used. Discover, so I assume you discover one of the three, the bat, no matter what class you're playing, will within the three. Interesting. Yeah. Celestial Dreamer. If you have a friendly minion that has five more attack gain, plus two, plus two. Huh, not bad, actually. If your opponent's hand is empty, gain charge. Okay, trash. I don't see why you would want this one. I don't know, actually. This one might be good, actually. Alright, we're going to start breathing through these a little bit quicker now. Anything that catches my interest... Okay. Trash. Same as a Kodo, just one less and one less the stats. Seen these. Cabal, Crystal Runner. We're going to see more secret mages now, I can tell you that. Not that there were a shortage of them previously. Okay, so, if this minion has two more attack, draw a card. Unique. Nothing of interest. Oh, this one. This one got a lot of criticism. You know the regular mana worm for mages? Yeah, they made a even trashier tier version of this one. Hmm. After your opponent plays a minion, give a random minion in your hand plus two plus two. Interesting. Very RNG. Nothing of interest. All right, so we're we started with 80, <clears throat> 82 packs, but I'll consider 81 for the new expansion. We still haven't gotten a legendary. Hmm. Interesting. Maybe before we hit 50 packs, we'll get a legendary. I wonder if Blizzard actually dropped the rate of legendaries on the launch date just because of this. Like, yeah, we want you to buy more packs. Have fun getting trash cards. Someone 411 Murlocs. Five three for five. Discover maybe not. What is this? Choose a friendly minion. Shuffle a copy. Ooh, that one might actually be good. Very interesting. Yeah. 
I think I might actually have the worst luck possible in this game. We have not hit a legendary in 30 car or 30 openings. If you control a minion with six or more health, draw two cards. Ha! Ha! Ha, no. Hey, our first legendary in 30 packs. What up, game? Oh. Damage dealt by this minion also heals your hero. Define shield and taunt. Well, that's getting destroyed immediately because it has taunt. Fuck you, game. That thing, I don't even know. Like a white girl, I can't even. All right, let's move on. I've seen all those. All right, so we got our first legendary in 30 packs. Oh boy. Blood Fairy Potion. Ooh, that one might actually be good in a Demon Lock deck. We're just going all over all duplicates that we've seen already. Why game? Why? So by the time we get our next legendary, I'm assuming we're going to be in our 20s for packs. These are doubles. I've seen it at least once. Oh, we got a legendary. Shaku the Collector. This is a stealth minion. Whenever this attacks, add a random card to your hand from your opponent's class. So essentially, it's only getting one attack in. Hmm, for three mana, two, three. It's not that great, but the effect could be good if you get good luck. But other than that, I think this is a slightly below average card. Oh goody, two of them. Oh, we got a golden thing. What are those? Are those floating carrots? Oh, okay then. <laughs> all right then. Of all things, you can levitate carrots. No big deal. <laughs> Ooh, we got an epic. Ooh, double epics. Brass knuckles. That looks like it's expensive. That kind of looks like it would hurt. Getting hit by like a sharp jewel. Gain an empty mana crystal for each friendly minion. Oh my god. Dude, that thing is good. I don't know. You could get at least three. This one is good. Pilfered power. Unless it's uh, just what it... No, wait. No, that's permanent. Yeah, this is a really good card. In my opinion. That was a disgusting pack. Another double epic. We got two brass knuckles now. That potion that gave uh, 12 health, um, that could be used very well in Priest, I think. 
That was my first one of that one, so interesting. Holy, we got a golden epic. That's valuable. Silent Dominion with Death Rattle. That's very specific. That is very specific. I don't think it might be that good, but... Okay, then. It's golden. It's dust value. Interesting card. Alright, so we think we got two legendaries in total. <laughs> Blubber Baron. Alright, so hopefully we could get at least one more legendary. Two would be nice, but just one more, and I would actually be happy. We got two of them now. Come on, Orange Jesus. That looks like the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles kind of logo in a way, except with Murlocs. Very interesting game. Are you sure that might not be somewhat copyright? Abyssal Enforcer. Deal three damage to all other characters. Dude, that's like a Warlock Flame Strike, except. or a Hellfire. So you just toss this down, everything dies. I got. that might be good. I'm gonna try that one. Alright, game. One more legendary, I believe. Twenty packs left. Seventeen packs left. Still believe. We got an epic. Pilfered power. Oh. That actually might be good. I don't know if I want to have two of them in my deck, but I know having at least one is good. We got a golden getaway Kodo. You hype. Legendaries. It's a little concerning opening eighty packs, only getting two of them. I know they want you to spend more money, but dang. Nothing really outside of this now stands out. I think we've seen all of them at this point. We might have missed a few, but we'll go over them at the end. You know how many Jade Spirits I've seen? Like 15 of them.
<laughs> All right, game. I'm a little getting a little nervous now. We have six packs. I just want one more legendary. Jade Idol. I think I might have the worst luck of anyone. Oh! Oh, now all I need is a golden legendary. Don Honcho. Give a random minion in your hand plus five plus five. Um, do I think this is good? Not really, but it's a legendary and I'll take it. I'm happy. We got three legendaries and 80 packs. It sounds kind of bad, which is because it is kind of bad, but I mean, three is better than two. Epic, rare, rare. Well, good. We got two of these now. I'm actually kind of happy with these. This could be used very, very interestingly. Now that I see it's to a friendly character, just get rid of the thought of Shadow Priest. But I, I don't even know. This one might be good. I have to play with it. This one also seems pretty interesting. Alright, you know what would be amazing? Getting five legendaries from the final pack. Yeah, of course not. <laughs> Alright, so that has been it. Before you leave, though, I do want to take a quick look at everything that I have missed. Um, let's, first of all, let's get rid of this. So it's going to trigger me if I don't do that. And then we'll take a look at all the cards that I didn't collect in 80 packs. I assume all the legendaries, obviously. But, um, just like commons, rares, and other stuff. Alright, so let's take a quick look. Alright, we're going to push the button first. All right, so let's see. Gadgets in. What cards did we miss? Nope, we got... Oh, wait. That's Hunter. Ah. All right, well, we got a Jade Idol and Golden, but not a Common. So, fine. Lunar Vision. Draw two cards. Minions drawn. Cost two less. That's actually pretty interesting. Forgotten King. Gain 10 armor or refresh your mana crystals. Very interesting card, actually. Knuckles for the Hunter. 3 7. What? After this attack, this also hits the enemy hero. This has to be a troll card. What? Of course, it's in the Hunter. Oh my god. Why, Blizzard? Why you do this? Hmm. Greater Arcane Missile. Shoot three missiles at random enemies at zero three damage. For seven mana, I could just Flame Strike, but I mean, pff, it could hit your enemy's face for nine. If your deck has no duplicates, the next spell you cast costs zero. That seems like a really trashy card, but it looks nice. Small time recruits. Draw three one cost minions from your deck. That could be good, actually, potentially. Mana Geode. Whenever this minion is healed, summon a 2 2 crystal. If you're holding a dragon, discard or discover a card in your opponent's deck. Interesting. Whoa! That depends how early you get this card, it might be good. If your deck has zero duplicates, your hero powers cost zero this game. So for the rest of the game. Hmm, that might be good actually.
Wait, the counterfeit coin? Gain one mana crystal this turn only. They put a coin in this game. All right, then. Return a friendly minion to your hand as a combo. Eh. Wait. Oh, I thought this uh, class didn't have a legendary. I was like, wait a second. Whenever this attacks and kills a minion, gain stealth 5-5 five, five for 5. Interesting. Jade Claws. I still don't know what a golem jade golem does after this minion attacks a hero transform it into a random six cost minion could be better could be worse RNG Jesus storm guardian interesting unlicensed apocryphary when you summon a minion deal five damage to your hero Ooh, that kind of sucks if your deck has no duplicates summon all demons from your hand that could potentially cause chaos and, and win the game or lose you the game the next turn. <laughs> Deal three damage to all damage heroes. Interesting. Warrior has a lot of clears now. Give all weapons in your hand and deck plus one attack. Ooh, that's pretty good actually. Whenever this minion deals damage, gain that much armor. Charge card. Shuffle this minion into your weasel tunneler. That's a troll card. Uh, nothing else really stands out. Create a custom spell. What does that mean? Create a custom spell. Something I have to play with. Or I might actually get it then. Well, for the most part, we got... Uh, majority of the cards in 80 packs so aside from all of this if there's something good I'll just probably craft it but overall I think this is a interesting expansion I saw some good ones most of them are eh, but you never know and with that said I hope you guys enjoyed the video thanks for watching and you'll actually see some Hearthstone gameplay in the near future because I do want to play with the new cards so have a fantastic day see you guys later